futuristico Ok Rap futuristico Rap futuristico Well, regarding uh, Italy's chances for the impending tournament um, Basically, I think we've got no chance uh, Defensively, we are far too weak um, The full-backs are not good enough as defenders They're okay going forward But defensively, we look very shaky uh, The centre-backs are at best average Even uh, Chiellini, who's probably our most... Um, Uh, our most adept centre-back appears to be a, a penalty uh, waiting to happen sometimes quite clumsy so I think uh, on this occasion uh, because of our weak back line and, and most uh, tournament winning sides are built on uh, on great defences um, I think that, uh, that we, we have very little chance at all in winning winning this tournament um, so in short yeah um, Italy's chances are very, very slim, I think, this time round. For the surprise package, I think the Republic of Ireland uh, could spring uh, some, some shock results. I think with Trapattoni, they've got a very capable coach, uh, aided by Marco Tardelli. I think that they can uh, produce a very organised team. They may not have any absolute superstars that uh, sort of trip off the tongue, but they're going to be very good defensively. They're going to be a hard unit to break down. And as we know, if you don't concede goals, Uh, you don't usually lose a game so I think they could could shock some of the, uh, the teams especially like Italy and Spain um, so as a dark horse I think uh, the Republic of Ireland would be one to watch One of the players that I'm going to be uh, certainly keeping an eye on um, over the impending weeks uh, will be Alex Oxlade-Chamberlain for England, uh, especially with uh, the injuries that England have had in midfield to Gareth Barry and um, uh, Frank Lampard. I think uh, Oxlade-Chamberlain may well be thrust straight into the team um, and he's he's got good pace, but he's actually quite strong and very good Uh, technically I think he's better than uh, the likes of Aaron Lennon and Theo Walcott um, so one player I'm going to keep an eye on and I think everyone else should is uh, Alex Oxlade-Chamberlain If I was a betting man, I think I'd put uh, my money on uh, Germany. I think they have the complete team this time round, and a lot of the players are probably at their peak and they're at the top of the cycle uh, when it comes to um, being uh, a, a team that can win, can win a tournament. I think they've got good players all the way through, from defence to attack. Uh, historically, they've always been strong in tournaments. I think this time uh, the Germans will be the team to beat.